Hello to everyone. Thank you so much for joining. My name is David Ballack. I'm the program manager of Bike Arlington. This is one of the events that we put on over the course of Bike Month to kind of get people thinking about biking and biking more. So we're able to get in contact with uh, Liz Canning. She would also come and talk with everyone about, you know, how we can all kind of get more involved um, in family biking and make biking an even greater part of our life than it already is. We're also joined by Jillian Burgess with uh, Kittlecle Mass Arlington, currently the chair of the Families for Safe Streets in Arlington. Jillian's a great bicycle advocate. When I got pregnant with our second, I discovered e-bikes, which were absolutely crucial for me to keep biking. We enjoyed biking. It gave us um, that bit of movement, that bit of freedom, that bit of air in our lives that we didn't want to lose uh, just because we had kids. I think once people try it and they realize that this is a that cargo bikes and electric bikes are car replacements that the cost is not the impediment that it might seem to be and because we have this robust network you can try these things you can borrow people are so generous people will literally just lend out their bikes to to others who are considering buying Biking has meant so much independence for, for my kids as they are old enough to, to start biking on their own to some places, but also because they know where they're going. As a mom, you, you start to lose yourself in all of the things you've got to do. When you're biking, it is you that is doing it. For those who have not ridden an e-assist bike, I think you might think to yourself, oh, it's like driving a car, like I'm not doing it. It's not true at all. You are turning the pedals, you are steering, you have the, the fresh air around you, you are in your surroundings and you are master of, of the bike. It's still you, only better. I was already a bike-centric person and it was hard for me when I had kids and I couldn't ride. So when I got the car bike, um, I knew what it felt like for me. And the more I rode around, the more I got this reaction from people. I mean, everywhere, people smile and they point you out and they go, oh my God, look at that cool thing. What is that? You don't have to be crazy endorphin addict like me. You can just be somebody who wants a convenient, practical, low emissions, you know, way of getting around. Having your kids on your own bike, I don't know. I just love it. I still miss it. Mine are on there. I miss like being this three-headed animal of like and feeling the weight. And I loved when my kids were little that I could talk to them, I could see them, I could touch their hands, I could hit them on the helmet if they were fighting. I could, you know. And then we had this thing where the, we sort of pretended that the bike was like like Chitty Chitty Bang Bang and that she knew where to go and she knew where to take us and we could go anywhere. We never get lost because she would bring us back home.